At the end of the 19th century, the Frisbee family opened a bakery in Connecticut. They soon became pretty popular for their pies. Some local students at Yale University one day found themselves pretty bored, so they picked up some of these empty pie tins and threw them around. Fun fact, they would yell Frisbee to notify the other player to catch the disc. It soon started to spread to other colleges and universities across the country. People like Fred Morrison on the West Coast designed a durable plastic disc called the Pluto Platter in 1951. Whammo Toy Company paired up with Fred to make them in mass production in 1957. Now you can find at least 700 countries and about 7 million people that use frisbees to play with. You can even see people throwing frisbees with their dogs. There is even frisbee golf courses that you can go find all around the country. It's pretty cool how some bored college kids turn some old pie tins into a very much loved sport.